Hi, my name is Cyrus Antili, and this is the presentation for my project, Booktree, Book Development with Version Control. What is Booktree? Booktree is a GitHub clone optimized for book development publishing. It is meant to be accessible to known programmers and it is powered by GitLab. Why use GitLab? GitLab is open source. It is amongst GitHub's top 30 projects by stars has six people working full time on it and its feature set is already very close to that of GitHub. Features which you intend to implement on top of GitLab. Whenever users push or save markdown or latex input, they will get HTML PDF and EPUB output compiled and hosted for them. We will provide side by side output preview while editing on the web interface. For HTML output, update as you type is already possible via tools such as Dillinger.io, which is JavaScript based. For PDF output, update when a button click is possible via tools such as Share Latex. Furthermore, if the PDF and HTML outputs are similar, then having just an HTML output preview might already be enough. Users will be able to do everything via the web interface, including resolving pull requests and multi-file comments. Users will be able to sell the compiled output online. We will implement upvote based metrics for everything, including users, projects, issues, and comments, so that the best users get due recognition and to make it easier to find the best projects. In this section, we will discuss contacts we have made with other projects and features which we feel those projects lack. Above all, we wish to stress we want to collaborate and not compete or implement features which other projects already have. Before we start a disclaimer. If we misjudge any other project, please correct us and we will promptly update this presentation. The two projects which are most similar to ours are Benyan and Overly Atlas. They are both GitLab based publishing tools. However, we are currently waiting to review both of them. We have contacted the Benyan team and they said they intend to go open source in the near future. However, their sign up is currently disabled. Open Atlas is currently 
directly on private on request access beta. We have requested access and are waiting for the reply. GitHub currently has no book output and requires the command line interface for several important operations. Furthermore, there are closed source, which forces us to use the API to interact with them. And we feel that we could get a better product by interfacing directly with the core. We have contacted them, offering to implement missing features for free. But their answer was keep checking the job board. GitLab has similar features to GitHub. However, since they are open source, we have already implemented some features for them. Also, based on their accepted feature requests and by talking directly to the project lead, we feel that they are open to some of the features this project intends to implement. Our pub is working on the GitHub editor and PDF CI, both of which allow for PDF output. However, they are GitHub based, and we feel that working with GitLab would give us greater flexibility. We look forward to working as closely as possible with this project. I have already contacted Katie Fletcher and Philip Schatz and are waiting for the reply. There are many similar projects which are not Git based. While some of them do have Git like functionality, we feel that none of them match the power of a fully blown Git web interface. Some of those projects are connections, share latex. Share latex has a Git backend, however, they take no markdown input. Also, we have contacted the share latex team and they are not very interested in interfacing with GitLab. Right latex is very similar to share latex, however they are closed source. There are also other projects which propose to sell a compiled output online. These include LinkPub, which is closed source and has no latex input, Softcover, which has no editing web interface. We have contacted the soft cover team and while they are not interested in interfacing with GitLab for the moment, we and the GitLab team feel that there is a good possibility for a markdown and latex backend. This explains how we intend to charge for our services to keep our project economically self-sustainable. If your book is open source, then you will get all the features for free. If you are closed source, you may have to pay. We will offer paid support to free local installs since like GitLab, we also intend to be installable locally for free. We will take a small margin from book sale. And finally, we wish to stay as open source as possible. Why is this project a good idea? We will be 
we're using existing programming tools because we feel that books are very similar to code. Therefore, we don't have to do that much work, only adapt existing tools. There are other projects with insufficient feature subsets which are already profitable. For instance, we feel that share latex or limpub are less powerful than what we intend to do. Specializing in books differentiates us from projects like GitHub because we will be able to compile everything from the web interface without the command line sell the compiled output online. Students will be greatly motivated by contributing themselves to books that they use. Teachers will collaborate with other teachers from all over the world to develop the perfect educational material. I am doing this project. Currently, students mostly suffer and waste their time in school, while they could be doing very useful and interesting things instead. What they need is more choice of what to learn, better and cheaper learning material, and to be able to actively learn by contributing themselves. GitHub and similar tools shows us that great free projects are possible and that people will contribute just for the thrill and recognition they get out of it. Therefore, if Code and text are actually similar, then the same should be doable for learning material. My final goal is to get closer to my ideal learning system in which there are no classes, no distinction between teachers and students, only metrics that indicate who knows more about a given subject, and in which everyone reads and writes whatever learning material they want. Contact us for suggestions or corrections at contact at g mail.com For the latest updates, visit github.com slash seriously slash book tree Thank you for watching and look forward to hearing your feedback.